All right, guys. Um, I need to do a mic check because I haven't done a mic check yet. And uh, if I don't do a mic check and it doesn't work, then that's a thing. So that means the mic's working. Um, all right, so we left off last uh, completing a quest and with the weird lady who's following us around, uh, Amy or something. Oh shit, I forgot my glass. So I need to go get it because that's what you put beer in. Um, so I was up there jamming out to a, like uh, November rain. And I don't know if you guys are a big Guns, Guns N' Roses fan, but I am. So the extended edition of November rain and uh, yeah, pretty good. So I'll be right back. I need to get a glass for my deadhead. Hazy IPA. Right there. Yeah, see the the uh, the distilled label and then it's a double IPA. It's fabulous, fabulous. Be right back. I'm gonna pause it and we'll continue. All right, I'm back. Uh, the wife's watching Too Hot to Handle with her friend. And, um, you know, it's it's okay for like 10 minutes because everyone's naked in bed and stuff. And then uh, 10 minutes, it's still the same thing. Nothing else happens and they don't expect any more of these guys. So, done, right? just the way it goes it's like reality shows are nice but if you you know i mean they're all dumbass fucktards pretty much um so it's entertaining for a little bit it is it is i mean bravo's got a thing right it's entertaining my wife likes it uh, her friend likes it everyone seems to well who watches it seems to like it Andy Cohen seems to like it. So you watch that stuff. Pretty good. Until it's like the same thing over and over and over again. And you're like, hmm. Then you need a break. And then when you go back, the same thing isn't so bad. All right. So we went and we applied our extra whatever artifact to this thing, and now it's a sort of circle thing going on there. That's fine. What else do we have? The Empty Nest is our quest line we are on. The Old Neighborhood. Talk to Sarah. Talk to Sarah. Wait for Sarah. Like, shit, seriously. All right, so there's no more. Uh, into the unknown, talk to Vladimir. Return to the Vectera. Or talk to Sam Code. Sam Co. C O E. Mm. What do you got? Hmm? Hey. We should probably uh, go and find Vladimir Tarasenko for all you guys who love hockey. It's been ages since like Constellation has had someone here. for this. Dude, the artifacts just go easy on Mateo, you're you like, exactly the best you're just volunteering up all this dialogue and I'm not even paying attention to you. You must be the latest poor fool to get dragged into our dysfunctional little family. Maybe, dude. Maybe. You don't need to be uh, an asshole about it. Whoa. I know a few dark sides of the Aquila moons, but if you're looking for deep history lessons, well, I'm going to fall asleep before you do. Trust me. Don't encourage him. Coraco, by the way. Hi, hi. Coraco. That's cool. Good to meet nice you, to Cora. meet anyone brave enough to fly the frontier. Know a thing or two about spacecraft, do we? Where'd you come from? Hey, don't spook our new friend. Frontier's a fine ship. Honest. 
No. Now, let's talk business. Listen. Sarah, give me a new ship. I'm not buying it. Just give me one. Sure enough. That's where we're heading. The three of us are heading to Aquila. For a settled planet of the Free Star Collective and... Alright, he's aboard. Him, the home of their capital, Aquila City. We'll land in the city's spaceports, but the frontiers are goal. It's a rough country. Spawned a lot of stories. And I got a lead on a tale that um, makes me think one thing. Artifact. So it's interesting. So I went upstairs and I was jamming out. We got this Bluetooth speaker. Sounds really, really good. So I had a DJX playlist that he created. DJX is an AI. And it was all like kind of 90s grunge stuff. Pretty good. I, 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 I have to admit it was, it was good. I mean, yeah. All right. Um, anything I should yeah, know about Akira? Don't piss off the Free Star Rangers. As far as the Collective is concerned, they're judge, jury, and executioner. They're the good guys, but that don't make them any less dangerous. Outside that, just don't be an asshole. Like you? Goodbye. What else do we have? This dude, Mateo? Are you doing okay? I'm not sure anyone really asked yet. Don't want you to think we're focused on the artifacts and nothing else. Dude, you man. matter too. You've done something really significant bringing that artifact here. I'm Mateo. Theological scholar by trade, but now, well, an explorer like you. What are you really wearing on your head, Mateo? Listen, everybody who knows the word or the name Mateo is thinking of some kind of soap opera with that dude. I mean, maybe you're not, right? Because you're probably like in your 30s or 20s and you don't even know what I'm talking about. It's fine. Fine. I wish I didn't know what I was talking about. <laughs> to be honest. Second one was on Kazal. Buried the same as the one you found. But the first one, right under our noses for years, sitting in storage, masquerading as an oversized paperweight. Can you imagine potentially the greatest discovery in human history collecting dust? Um. Okay. I'm not gonna lie. I really wish I could have seen this for myself. It's hard to judge otherwise. Both you and Barrett saw something. I don't think that's a coincidence. Did it feel like it was trying to tell you something? I don't want to necessarily use the words divine revelation, but you know, if the label fits. It told me to kill Mateo. <laughs> Evidently that's funny only to me. Um, uh, maybe just going crazy. All I know is an experience. No. It has Important. to be, right? All of this is connected. We just need to figure out how and why. I mean, we're gonna get to I'm the not gonna glorify this. anything because more I data, think that's bullshit. Which means more artifacts. Like in the world, it's glorifying everything that you could possibly think of. The news, the weather, sports, school, everything. We will have a touching on topics on just that rant and how mm -hmm, everybody gets a gold star. You, uh, you okay? Yeah. If you let me talk and stop pestering me and pressuring me to say something, Mateo is just like others. All right. Well, there was some overlap in interests. I'd spent years searching for religious relics from human history. I had made a really incredible discovery, only to lose it to a greedy corporation. Am I in a good spot here? So I because tried to steal I've back. been fucking. In the process, I met Walter. Wait. Turned out he owned the corporation. After a long talk, we realized we had a lot in common. Good. And I was invited to join Constellation. 
Take care I of yourself. I ain't got nothing for you, dude. Tail. I don't know. I don't even know what your point of any of that was. Dude. Stop. Well, I suppose calling you a rock breaker may have been a bit out of line. I don't. I don't honestly remember that. So. Still doesn't go. excuse it. My frustrations lie more with Barrett. Not the first time his shenanigans. Listen, Barrett, we need to talk to. Our ventures. Not fair of me to take it out on you, especially since it would seem he made the right call this time. So, let's start over, shall we? Walter Stroud, CEO of Stroud Eklund, member of Constellation, and oft times grumpy old man. Welcome aboard. Me too. By the way, in addition to a place to stay, the Lodge has a wealth of modification and research equipment. Spacesuit customization, pharmaceutical manufacturing, testing alien substances, the whole thing. You can even fashion industrial pieces for large-scale projects, if you don't mind extracting a few raw resources from a nearby planet, that is. I'm a fan of self-reliance, so I encourage you to make use of the tools we have to build what you need. Where you looking there, uh, dude? Craft or modify an item. Okay. Complete a research project. Funny thing about companies, you build one sturdy enough, it doesn't need you there all the time to prop it up. Stroud Eklund functions quite would well like on a day to day basis. I would like that. Leaving me time to devote to more esoteric pursuits. For years, I was captivated by the writings of Constellation's founder, Sebastian Banks. I finally decided to do Dude, something more. Than you're admire finally existence. looking at me? And so now, I call the Lodge home as much as anywhere else. Me? <laughs> Why, I'm the wallet. Someone has to fund yeah. all this, and all my success in business doesn't mean much if I can't put it to good use. I don't pretend to have the daring of Ms. Morgan or the smarts of young Mateo, but I can make sure that they have the resources they need. And, as you've now seen, those resources aren't being wasted. We're onto something big here. I'm gonna tell you that Mateo is. Okay. Up until very recently, I'd likely have dismissed it as, I don't know, hallucinations. But now, I'm not sure what to think. I don't suppose you have a history of this sort of thing, do you? Hmm. This, or anything else. You'll have to forgive me. I don't know you as well as the others here. If you weren't so new to the group, I might already know the answer. Yes, I imagined as much. Barrett expressed something similar in his own unique way. I'm no scientist. I leave that to the likes of Barrett and young Noel there. But I think we can all agree mm -hmm. there's something unusual going on here. Frankly, this is the most exciting thing that's happened in years. Great. We're most well known for ship manufacture. No expense spared. If you want the best and can afford it, you choose Stroud Eklund. Unfortunately, our success means you'll sometimes see Stroud Eklund ship modules on less than reputable vessels. They covet them. The bastards. I've tried to convince the United Colonies we can help in that regard, but they're married to Deimos Star Yards, and those old salts are stuck in the glory days. Tell me more what you want. Okay. Remember, you're representing all of us out there. That's fine. I mean, 
I like getting info, so tell me more, dudes. I hope you are satisfied with the quarters available to you. Dude, Captain, dude. now that you are a member of Constellation, I am at your service. No additional protocols necessary. Also, given the likelihood that you will be out in unsettled space, it might be beneficial to go over exploration outpost development. We kind of want Vasco, right? He's all right, right? The exploration of an unknown planet can Maybe be a major him. undertaking. By building an outpost, you will be able to construct scanning equipment, resource extractors, and defenses. And it we can build that and lease him there. Multiple outposts capable of manufacturing, allowing you to build advanced equipment. The scan booster is the most obvious, as it will enable you to detect landmarks and other points of interest from further away. Beyond that, extractors will allow you to collect raw materials of various types, while Sounds fabricators good. enable the manufacturing. A particularly prosperous outpost may even warrant the construction of cargo links allowing you to share resources between other outposts you have built. A planetary scan will reveal the presence of key inorganic resources, although rarer elements will be harder to find without training. And while a scan may detect the presence of life on a planet, you will have to analyze the native plants and animals yourself to know what compounds they produce. The blueprints you need to construct an outpost should already be on your watch. It will automatically connect to any available materials for construction in your ship's cargo. My primary function has been to support and protect Barrett during his travels. I am currently unable to do so. That is as capable as I can be of missing anyone. I believe Barrett would find your question amusing. Mm -hmm. Barrett has thus far survived every mission on which we have embarked. It is therefore evident that my efforts have been successful. I suspect that Barrett would disagree with how necessary my intervention has been in any given situation. I arrived along with many material goods purchased by the group's previous chair, Malcolm Livingstone. Despite mm -hmm. several significant system replacements and upgrades, I have been online for 43 years. Captain, I will proceed to my assigned post. All right, so they're both on uh, Frontier. Nice. Oh, you must be the new member. Listen, I was just talking to the dude there. It's the best. I met another kid my age who hadn't been on a starship once. Not even once. Same boring old planet for like years. She didn't even know how to replace a phase manifold. Can you imagine? Can I imagine? I can't imagine. I want to fly my own ship and go all over the place. Like you and Dad, really. But hopefully not as crazy as your travels. I thought Dad's were exciting. <clears throat> but yours? Brr. I read. I look around the ship, but no touching. Dad lets me do all sorts of stuff on his ship. But he said I have to be respectful on your ship. But I could try to fix things if you ask. Hint, hint. 
you can ask. I promise I'll be good. Bye. Great. And I have you must be the latest poor fool to get dragged into our dysfunctional little family. No. Funny story, caught this one stealing my ship. Only reason I didn't turn her in is because we have the same last name. Dad. All right. That's my one. What? What? Just a friendly jab. Small group like this, you'll learn more about everyone than you ever wanted to. Kind of all that family is, in a way. Like, more than you'd ever want to know. Hello, kids are around, people. Koriko, by the way. Hi, hi. Listen, we know what your name is. What the hell is going on here? And I gotta say, I already... My goodness gracious. It helps to have a good teacher. Dad, don't let it go to your head. Sam, not let it go to his head. <laughs> Impossible. A compliment from little Cora. Well, it's not even my birthday. Now, let's talk business. Sarah tell you about the expedition? I feel the same. Yeah, I always get antsy planet side. What is this dude the doing? He's tweaking into everything. For a settled planet of the Free Star Collective and not coincidentally, the home of their capital, Aquila City. We'll land in the city's spaceports, but the frontier is our goal. It's a rough country. Spawned a lot of stories. And mm -hmm. I got a lead on a tale that um, makes me think one thing. Artifact. Didn't we uh, hear that already? All right, so. Okay. Let's go. We'll meet you on board your ship. Talk more when we get there. Once we land on Aquila, it's going to be you and me. So if you want to do any freewheeling before then, Cora and I will just be riding passenger. This is all exciting, but there's really a lot of pressure on us, isn't there? We have to get this right. Dude, man, we're leaving behind. We're not even bringing you, because you're a fucking tool. You're a fucking tool. Right, let's Captain, let's uh, do you require my assistance? Let's take a, a nap. Is my uh, quarters here? Uh, all right. Somebody else owns that bed. Where's my quarters? Here? No. What are you doing? Mm -hmm. Goodbye. Somebody else's. Why would they do that? Why wouldn't they, like, give me the first bed, right? That's a bathroom. Every, every bed is taken. How many is actually no else in there? Jesus. This one? No. Um, I didn't think I would be searching around for the bed. You cannot, no. I can't sleep there. How about in the broom closet? Just let me do that. Oh, hey, we found it. 
Uh, we're going to sleep eight hours. We're going to sleep ten hours. <laughs> Hello. Good morning. You're still wearing your clothes. Yes. Fine by me. Time to go? I guess I can't romance her. No. Um, all right. Let's go this way and this way. Greetings, Captain. New Atlantis. Here we go. Um so let's let's uh see what to talk to Sam Cole. Um, I guess there isn't anything else to do on this place. Fine. Fine. She's got a pretty, pretty straight, uh, plain Jane name, Sarah Morgan, right? Pretty plain Jane. Here we go. Base port. Now, can I just look at the map and then choose that and not have to run back like that? Maybe. That would be cool. We wouldn't have to worry about things. Let's just look. Um, The ship there. Wow, we have quite a few um, quests. Start an outpost. Wow. Cool. Overwhelming? Maybe. Mm. 
I need to be with Vladimir. All right. Where's Vladimir? He's at the fringes of space. Oh, he's over here. Can I make it? to a closer system. This one? No. This one? Can go here. That's good. I guess we made it to Olympus. And now we can go here. We go straight here. Made it here. Wait. to do the uh, visual effects, that's fine. Grab drive speed, all right, Sam. Another ham you enter free and start collecting space. Maintain your current course bench. while we scan for contraband. Oh, come on, Sarah, not this again. I'm telling you, there's no point in setting up that wager. So all you right, intend good. to stick with the Welcome ridiculous notion that the beer served at the... Listen, dude, I don't even know what's happening right there. There's so many people talking over each other. Oops. Um, how do I get back into that? Itching post is better than Jake's. Better than Jake's? Better than Madame Sauvage's place in Neon? Better than anywhere. Hands down. <laughs> you must have banged your head on a console during that last grab jump. So no why, why do... Make a claim like that. All right, look, you want to throw your money away, I'd be happy to take it. Otherwise, let it go on me. One day, we're going to system hop and test your theory. I just hope you're ready for some serious disappointment. Open my net map. Mining outpost. There it is. Here we go. Beginning landing cycle. I hope you guys are having a good night. Good day today. Today is is Wednesday for me. Um, I hope to post this on Thursday. And um, I hope Thursday is a good day. I mean, today was a, a pretty hectic day 
but um, got better once I started recording for you guys. I'm just saying it did. All right. We're planning on staying a while. We could grab a room at the Stone Root Inn. The Stone Root Inn. How do you know that? Hmm? It was soft. All right, we're here. You ready? Because once we get started, I'm gonna be riding your tail till this is over. What's that mean? What's that mean? She stays with the ship, usually. Got a few more years to go before I let her swill whiskey in some backwater bar. Listen. There's uh, something you should know up front. There's there's something to be said for a backwater Listen, bar. Solomon Coe, first man on Aquila. That tale I mentioned before, the one I think is connected to an artifact, it's something of a family legend. After planet fall, Solomon spent years mapping Aquila. And he found a tiny little patch of nothing on his senses. The kind of nothing an artifact produces. He called it the empty nest. Said it was a place mm -hmm. even the wildlife of Aquila wouldn't go. Mm -hmm. Because you'll find a whole lot of nothing. Gravitational anomalies are a little hard to pick up in an area with tons of starship traffic. Not to mention all the electronics from the city and security scramblers that the Free Star or smugglers out on the frontier put down. Yeah, and the Coers have been coasting on that for ten generations now. Solomon's always a larger-than-life figure if you read the histories, but if you just listen to a few recordings of the man, he was simple. Just wanted to keep moving forward. Solomon's maps are locked up tight in the local gal bank. We'll be heading there. All right. There's something I need to talk to you about. I'm well, listening. Okay. Thanks for taking the time to talk. I wanted to ask you about the artifact you found on Vectera. When you pulled it from the rock, held it in your hands for the first time, how did you feel? No, no, I, I don't think you understand. I know about the visions, the light, and the music. How did you feel inside? What were your thoughts? Hmm. Um. Raw energy? I've never heard that one before. I shouldn't be surprised. The artifacts aren't exactly what you'd call normal. Honestly, I wasn't sure how you'd react. Some people would consider what you went through a deeply personal experience. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I, uh, I enjoy hearing about them. Professionally, of course. Either way, um, we need all the help we can get. The artifacts are so different, so alien. And I'm certain one of them reached out and spoke to you. Quite the mystery. Mm hmm Well... Judging from the fact that both you and Barrett claim to have heard music, I've made the leap that the artifact was reaching out. Music composition might not consist of words and sentences, but I'll be damned if that isn't an attempt at language. So here we, here we go. Are you guys ready? Reaching out. Reaching out. Right? That, um... 
what do you want to call it? Jargon? Is only new to the last two years? Reaching out? Usually, usually uh, before that, we would call somebody, right? But now we're reaching out to them, right? It is what it is. All right. This silence Ciao. is getting awkward. Oh, that's an excellent question. You should think after years of gathering data about the artifacts, I'd have the perfect answer to that. But I haven't the faintest idea. <clears throat> Not much, I'm afraid. All I have to show for my efforts are eyewitness accounts, scores of inconclusive metallurgical test results, and wild theories. Oh, no, not at all. There's so much going on there, I can't afford to divert all of our resources. But I have classified the artifacts as a priority project. Okay. Talk to you later. Anyway, as I was saying, the artifacts aren't exactly what you'd call normal. If there is, the artifacts are doing a heck of a job hiding it. The artifacts are so different, so alien, and I'm certain one of them reached out and spoke to you. Quite the mystery. You guys hear any of this reaching out in any other game or in life two years before today? Nobody reached out except Neil Diamond, right? Just saying. Is that the new jargon and it's in the game like <clears throat> the normal thing? Is that? <laughs> After spending years <clears throat> gathering data about the artifacts, You'd think I'd have all the answers. Frustrating? No. Bewildering? Yes. It would be... Oh, well, an explorer's dream to solve a mystery like this. Mm-hmm. I knew I picked the right person for the job. Look, I wanted to thank you for taking the time to talk and for keeping an open mind. And mm. I also wanted to say, well, I'm pleased we're on this journey together. <laughs> it's the best decision I've made in quite a long time. Okay. Can I help? Bye for now. So, in order to... Alright, we need to go this way. In the city. Oh, hey. A place we can sell stuff. You'll have a tech free? That's not a problem. Great authority kiosk. 108 of 135. Uh, weapons. Bad. Three helmets. 
Oh, that one's only 103. 18 physical, 29 physical, 35 physical. So let's sell this and this. All right. Let's uh, equip a new helmet. <laughs> uh, do I have all of these? What's this thing? Damage three. So, um, there's stuff, like, all over the place. If I had all the time in the world, I would go over there. But I don't. So we're not. Hey, what can I do for you? I wish all the ports worked like Achilles City. Ship no, services technician. Nothing for us to do. You're in good flying condition. All right. We got to get to that vault in Galbank. My ship is just fine. That's fine. Hold it. By order of Marshal Daniel Blake, I need to inform you we've got some trouble at Galbank. Folks might be in danger, so you may want to steer clear. Just behind me on the right. The place is on lockdown, so you should steer clear unless you can help out. I guess that'd be the marshal's call. Frankly, it ain't going well. Looks to be a stalemate. Maybe a little outside help would do some good. Well, I doubt those robbers are gonna let us leisurely peruse the Galbank hey, vault. We better see if we can help move the situation along. If you make a move toward the building, the rock the might have some dies. work for someone like you. Are you planning to tell me your demands at some point? This is nothing you we can't have. someone we can trust, and maybe we will. Like who? Not you, but not one of your rangers, and not these city guards, neither. <sighs> what the hell am I supposed to do with that? You need to stand back now. I don't mean to be rude, but I don't know you. Now, please, stand back. Aquila City at its finest, I see. Never a dull moment. Mm -hmm. well, I'll be damned. Sam, Sam Cole. Cole. Been a long time. I won't hold my breath about you being here to take the badge again. Uh, listen, Sam, just so you know, I don't blame you for how it went down. Mm -hmm. The others, though, you might get a different reception. Thanks. I appreciate you saying so. Glad I figure some of that reception is owed. Still, I appreciate the sentiment, Marshal. It seems you got a situation. My friend here may be the answer you're looking for. All right, Sam. I'll trust your judgment on this one. Some folks from the Shaw Gang tried to rob the place, but they got spotted by a guard. They took everyone inside hostage, and now they're keeping a watch so we can't move. Oh, yeah? Them. They're using the intercom to communicate. Duh. It's a big group that hides outside the city and runs smuggling jobs off-world. They take in all kinds, rookies and veterans alike. Judging by their lack of preparation, I'd say this particular group is green as hell. Probably their first attempt at heist. That should work in our favor. Nice. Right about now, they're probably wishing they'd just stayed home. They won't talk to me. Say they don't trust the badge. <laughs> they want a neutral negotiator. In other words, they didn't have a plan for this, so they're stalling while they come up with one. Hmm. All right, I'm willing to allow that. But a few things first. 
Say what you have to. Whatever they ask for, there's no way in hell I'm giving it to them. Also, there are lives at stake, so don't get cavalier. You don't, Find you don't out want to what kill people. Innocence. Back to me. Take it slow and steady. Look for every opportunity to de-escalate. You got this. Hey, you in the back. Why does everybody not want to shoot? The negotiator, so don't shoot. Can't I'm sure things will turn out just fine. Nothing. Says that spacers and the fleet are getting worse. You're the negotiator, huh? If you think you're just gonna walk up here and get us to surrender, you're dead wrong. We'll cooperate when we get what we want. <coughs> Tell me, stranger, how do I know you're going to deal straight with us? <laughs> I don't know you, so why should your word mean anything to me? Wow. See that? Uh, two, four, six, eight, ten. That's not good. Jesus, look at that. I have three turns to get 10 friggin' things. Maybe you're right. Nobody gets hurt, we won't have to rot in jail for the rest of our lives. I have one more turn and I and I okay
part of me just wants to be rid of these people. But we need them right where they are. Nah, it's too late to back out now. We're seeing this through. You go tell the Marshal to get that ship ready so we can all walk away from this thing without anybody getting hurt. Unfortunately, we're going to have to load this up. Do it again. Until we can get that right. Because that was like two of like... Eight things. for you. Well, I see your parents didn't skimp on your P's and Q's. I spotted it on our last planetary foray. All part of the service. Hey, I'm gonna pick things up one way or the other. I'll keep my eyes peeled. Who knows? Check in with me now and again and I might find more. Alright. Maureen, thanks. That requires a key. I don't have a key. Security around here is a joke. I heard every word. He's talking too loud. Sign of fatigue. All that fear and exhaustion are taking a toll. They're not thinking straight. That puts us in a very precarious position. I appreciate your idealism, but there were only ever two ways. You've already ruled out one of them, so that leaves us with only one option. We have to free the hostages. Problem is, they're keeping me and the guards in sight at all times. If we try to move against them, they'll see us coming. You'd be willing to do that? You've got mm -hmm. guts, that's for damn sure. I can't deny that you're right, though. They might not see that coming. Now, I see two ways we can play this. You could ask to see the hostages. And once you're inside, you can make it if you're quick. I think you can take them out before they have a chance to respond. But you'll have to shoot to kill. There's also a back door. Most of their attention's focused out front here, so they may not be watching it as closely. This key should unlock it. That's what I, I want. I have complete confidence in the marshal. All right, so let's um, save as a new save. Right, it's uh, one, two, three, six. Well, maybe I just ain't taking any chances. You make a fair point. Uh -uh. I see what you're trying to do, see? but there's no way the marshal takes that chance. I'm done talking about this. You've got now go tell the marshal that I want my gut. I probably can do that. I probably can make the correct decision right there. Uh, I don't know though. Let's try. Let's give it a shot, guys. 
What's the marshal say? We have a deal? I guess that'd be all right. You're gonna need to ditch that weapon. Fine, but make it quick. You gotta look like you're up to something. And I don't like it. All right, That's that all. didn't work. Sorry, I'm and not that didn't the work either, move. so okay. So we need to one first. Okay. Okay. All right. Number one first. You guys see that uh, uh, Walking Dead uh, Norman Reedus thing? I think I'm. Um, I think I'm gonna watch that. What the marshal say? Evidently, it looks a lot like The Last of Us, but. I guess that'd be all. Right. Gonna need to ditch that with. Fine, but make it. I guess the marshal can't assume any. I guess I'd feel the same if I were in your place. I have four, four more. I don't have four. I'm going to have a five. I don't know a thing about no, that you. Didn't, that didn't I'm go. done talking. I mean that was an easy one. All right, fine. Over. Well, you so much as look at me, funny. I'm so we got persuasion, me. so that helps hey, our uh, doors what we need in order to advance our skill. So we can save this. Nice, nice. Sometimes when you see those sixes and fives, you're like, I don't think so. something valuable stashed away in here. Don't you lie to me now. You don't understand. The vault is for storing priceless heirlooms and relics from the yes. city's pro history. Um, oh. Shut up! You're wasting my time and I'm sick of it! I'm gonna count to five. And if you ain't told me what, what I want to know, I'm gonna blow your head off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm telling you the truth. Please. I have a wife. Five. Four. that do can't take much more of this yes what Hmm. 
never coming back to this rock. Figure something would Dude. go wrong on the first job. You shot that guy? We can't have, uh... I don't think we can have that guy killing people. Follow me. Okay. They're in the vault, down there. Hey! Negotiators coming down to check the hog and in here with old Chuck. Where's the good stuff, old man? I know. A good guy. Time to change. Please tell me this is going to end soon. these dudes. I might have missed something inside. Just saying. Bummer. 
let's go back in and see if we missed anything. Because evidently we have, we have, we can do this. No pads. Dude, Thank what, you so what's much. Up? You're welcome, dude. Now I have two heroes, Solomon Co. and you. Hey. Advance. We can do it. We can do advanced. All right. There we go. Nope. No. Nope. No. Nope. Okay, so one tower. Two. Yep. All right, let's look at let's look at the one on the inside. That's the only one that really matters. Nope. Yep. All right, then we'll go one more. So this is here. Nope. 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 Yep. So if we go back here. ring or outside ring no inside ring no see we're here on the inside ring no right no there if we go inside ring here no so this this fourth one doesn't do anything All right, so we have, we have, uh, let's go back to the beginning. We have this going here on the inside, and then that going there on the inside. And this going, can this go on the outside? doesn't but this must go on the inside not there not there no nope. wait there so this for sure is the inside so that's for sure the inside and then this is the inside. That does that and that. So this is not the, the okay. So the, that one does three inside ones. This one does the other. So the entire inside stuff was done with these two. This one, though, has to be outside. It has to be. There's no other explanation. This is not even used. That's not used.
and neither is that. Right? I, I messed the whole thing up because of that. That doesn't work. Nope. 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 this this is two in a row and no even if I wanted to, to use this I can't no way strange all right So we know that, uh, oh wait, is this, oh my god, it's different, it's different. Outside and inside. Think about this for a second. So uh, load up the auto save and then we'll do it again. This is an outside one. Uh, that's gotta be an inside one. This right here.
little bit tough. Crazy. a tough one this advanced one tough one i thought i had the uh, very first one we did thought i had a good beat on it uh, but i didn't i hope the marshal gives you a big reward all right so here we go here we go so what does this match not that um, there, no. On the inside track, no. So this doesn't match the inside track at all. This one. Inside track. Inside track. Inside. Inside. This matches four inside tracks. This one. All inside. I'm 100% sure this is going to be the inside one. Okay, so we have two inside ones. This one is doing. Uh, where where is the inside track here? No. No, this is not inside at all. Maybe outside. I mean, it has to be outside. Right there. It has to be outside. It's not inside. And this must be inside, this one. It must be right here. So, outside. Wait. This does all of those, so it only leaves those two. How does that work? Oh, it has to be this. Nope, it's not. I'm like, that has to be the inside, but then we have, we don't have enough for the outside. So I, I would say that this must be here because it's the only place it could possibly be and that's the inside track. So if that does all three of those, then we have just those two down there. Right here, but it can't do that because it's missing one. That doesn't work either. Man. 
do some bullshit here, man, guys. All right, let's look at the outside one. We only have three left to do. It's probably this, right? No. Wow. Wow. Crazy. That doesn't, this doesn't work for anything on the outside. There isn't one with one, so this isn't a thing. Wow. That's my undo. harder than I thought. It is. I thought I had a beat on what was happening. I I don't. I don't. Try it again. Wait. Here. That was incredibly brave of you. Thanks. Now, how do you do this? All right, so the outside, um, it can be anything, right? So the inside. Can't be there. Can't be there. This can't be, this cannot be the inside right because it doesn't match up to anything on the inside so it must be on the outside I mean, there's no other option, right? That must be on the inside. This is gotta be on the outside. If I have to use them all, this is the only place for this to go. It won't go here. It can only go here. I guess I don't have to use them all. That's uh, a learning experience right there. Hill of Two Cities. And a med pack. That's mine. Give it back. Don't be stupid. Stop. Now. Amira Wolf at the Low House could really use someone helpful like you. After the job you did with the bank, it should be easy. Hold it right there. You're under arrest. Smart move. Now come along with us. 
We'll take any contraband and stolen property, and you'll be free to go. What? Put that back right now. Thief! Free Star Security! By the I authority of the Free Star that? Collective, stand down. You're coming with us. We'll be taking any contraband and stolen property you have on you. What is going on? What's going on? I'm just, I'm losing credits. How, how do I not? You heard of the Elios Retreat? It's supposed to be some new age healing center for reforming criminals or whatever. Going up in Exil 2. I'm not holding my breath. You stay on the straight and narrow. I guess. I mean, hell. Yes, since no one's up here, I can take stuff. Drunk and disorderly is our number one offense. All right, fine. I spent that long picking that lock, and I I don't even get to keep what what is in there. I mean, that's fine, right? I don't actually even know where I am right now. Sir, there's a bank robbery going on right now. Nice work. I heard the fight. The hostages, are they safe? Oh, yeah. That's... that's good to hear. Those people aren't just citizens of the Free Star Collective, they're like family. We all are. As for the Shaw Gang, we'll grieve for them too. Here, you've more than earned this. Give me enough credits to pay for spot. all the shit you that I just had to pay for. It's not common. As a matter of fact, you might just be Free Star Ranger material. If you're interested, head on over to the rock and ask for Emma Wilcox. She handles the new things. <clears throat> Alright, thanks. All right. Got the lines right on the line. Let's get back in Galbank, see if we can get those maps. Moving to Midtown is the best thing that's happened to us. Alright, guys. It's okay. We're going to uh, save it here. And we're going to hit this next time. So, thanks for watching. Um, I had fun making this episode. Uh, it was a little weird. I spent a long time trying to pick a lock. And I didn't even get to keep what was in there. But picking the lock allows us to increase our skill for lock picking. So it was good. Anyway, um, please subscribe and we will see you soon.